Hello YouTube, this is Mayun J. Uh, today the purpose of this video is to show you how to root the HTC One M7. Um, first what you must do is uh, go to settings on your phone. I'm sorry for the focus in here guys. You go to settings, you go all the way down to where it says developer options and you must have USB debugging enabled as usual uh, for uh, routing purposes, okay? Uh, once you have that done, all you have to do now is just connect your phone to the computer through the USB cable. See, I believe it goes like this. Okay, once your phone is connected, now your computer is going to read um, it's going to read your phone. Usually, if you uh, need to install the drivers uh, for the computer, all you have to do is just download um, Snappy, and Snappy will install the drivers automatically for you. It's uh, the easier way to root this phone. Okay, guys, so once you have it connected, uh, let's see here. Once you have it connected, now all you have to do is extract this uh, zip file. And you're going to see a folder like this. You can extract it anywhere in your computer. Um, then you're going to locate the folder. Okay, so once you locate the folder, you drop, double click on the, on the folder. Okay, so once you see the inside of the folder, you're going to see this batch file. You got to double click it. All right, and now what you're going to see is, uh, let me try to move this around. Now you're going to see this command prompt opening up. Um, all you have to do is just like it says, once the phone is connected, all you have to do is just press enter or press any key to continue. Okay, then you're going to see that it's going to stop here. What you have to do is you got to come back to the phone. And usually it's going to ask you a question saying uh, whether or not um, you want to install the application. So in this case, since I'm rooted, it didn't ask me that. Uh, but it will ask you if you're rooting it for the first time, okay guys? So once that's completed, all you have to do is just press any key to continue in order for the phones to reboot. So you do that, just that. So let's press any key here. Now you're going to see that your phone is going to reboot. There we go. So now your phone is rebooting. And that's pretty much it, guys. So now it's going to reboot back uh, to normal, and you should see uh, Super User on there. And I'm just going to wait for that. There we see it. The phone has rebooted. At this point, you can disconnect the uh, USB cable if you wish to do so. Let's wait until it boots up. It's almost done, guys. Fix my camera's a little crooked. There we go. All right, so now let's go ahead and verify if this phone is rooted or not. So what we're gonna do is uh, let's go here to the main page and let's see if we can buy and find super user. There we see it, guys. So now we have super user permissions. So this phone has uh, officially rooted. And let's go ahead and open this app called Root Explorer, which is, requires uh, permissions. And we see that it has granted permission for the root. Okay, so uh, that's pretty much it, guys. It's pretty much a one-click um, root method. If you have any questions, uh, please comment below um, or message me di directly. I'm going to provide the link for the download on the description. Um, thanks for watching. Please subscribe for more, and have a good one.